to the stream. My name is Charlie Agma, aka Agma Beats, aka Learner Learner for Life. Uh, we out here today, bruh. There's no other way to put it. Out here, not there. Today, are actually we're actually trying to learn some new things. Uh, today, I've been working on a few things. The Doctor Drums beat. Uh, the one that I worked on the other time, I'm working on the lyric video for a new joint that I'm about to release with my homie Isaiah Club Sadness, released on August 6th, so two more Fridays, from this upcoming Friday to next Friday, we're going to release it, so uh, mark your calendars, I'm going to leave uh, a pre-save thing actually right now, right now, Wednesday streams, I'm going to do... Uh, Wednesday learning earlier I was working on uh, the dr. drums set I was actually learning from Kenny beats the vocal chain I'm just gonna show y'all what I did earlier so he was showing things that I didn't know and like this could be like super basic for y'all but uh, I, I didn't know because I'm new to Ableton so one of the things that I noticed that is super easy to do is to group tracks for example you see how I have all of these things right all of these are dry they don't have any effects and the reason they don't have any effects is because the group is what has the chain I remember with that video he says repeat after me the group has the chain all of these are barely copied and then I just modified a little bit from whatever is needed for my room my stuff uh, one thing that I didn't use at all, the uh, CLA vocals. He had it in the chain there, but uh, I never saw him use it. And I haven't really activated it at all. And then he has this thing right here, right? The track, tracking track, which basically is to record. Basically, you record here, anything, and then you move it down to the main or the ad libs. And in the ad libs, of course, it's like a little similar. I have the gate. I have the SSL, I have the SR, and I have the two. The difference between this one and the main one is one, the main one has uh, basically different par parameters for. Bro, why do I keep saying parameters? Parameters, 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 parameters. The setting for volume is less here than here. And then, of course, here I have my sense. Here I don't have any sense, which is like the short reverb, long reverb. And in the reverb, uh, he had a different one. He used the waves one, and I just decided to use this other one. Stock plugin for reverb uh, on Ableton because it worked for me. Honestly, I don't even know why I uh, I left this MIDI here because I'm not any MIDI at all. Here you record. Yo 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 two 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 two, and then this one I just move wherever it needs to be done. And another thing, one of the things that I didn't that I didn't see him do, and I learned on my on my is that if you click on the right, because like you can loop it, right? You can loop it. This is uh, I, if I'm not mistaken, this is only on uh, Ableton Eleven. You can loop this. And like, for example, you can record that, right? Then it records over it, blah, blah, blah. Records over it, blah, blah, blah. Records over it, over it. And then basically here, if you put show take lanes, it, ta it, it shows you all the takes you took. And then from here, you can select the best take. Say I just want this part from this one. Select and then click enter, and then it selects that. And it selects L from this one. Say actually, and you can zoom in if you want. Boom. Zoom in and then boom. Have this thing like that. So yeah, here then. Can also do this I didn't see him do that but that is very useful as well and ah. 
Caminar una tarde más, este jardín espacial Recordando muchas cosas que no se hacen notar Como las piernas de esa morra nunca pude mirar O el vagabundo que un día ya no viste pasar Dudes abandoning la... And uh, that's all y'all are gonna get I don't know when I'm gonna release this, but very soon So stay pending, bro Stay pending to this, cause y'all already know the fire is within. Fire is within. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? I I've been drinking too much coffee with my pink uh cup, the eyelash pink cup. It's my favorite mug in the in the house. Here's the kalimba, bruh. This is a kalimba I've been having for a while. Uh, my girl got it for me. Uh, little kalimba. I, I'm pretty sure it's not even tuned. So basically, what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna take these and equalize them. Try to make uh, a nice beat with it. Ooh, I like that last one actually. What I'm gonna do is add a gate, of course. After the gate, I need a uh, equalizer. Not gonna overthink it that much. That's an E, right? I like that. <laughs> For real? Oh my god. That does it sound so good. Ooh, I like this one. Uh oh by the way, this is another thing that I just learned. Consolidate the MIDI clips. For example, here, right? Say I want the the start from from the one that I did the first take. Say you want like this to be only one MIDI because if you try to move this one, it just moves that, right? So you want to just put all of this thing in one thing, just consolidate. Chill, chill. It sounds like an anime, some weird stuff. Oh, we need one more. Bro, it happens that like I'm 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 just playing whatever and it sounds fire and then when I when I press the record button I just are playing like like booty. It's just a little demonstration with this 86 uh, BPM C major uh, loop. I'm gonna send them on a zip file or maybe uh, Dropbox or something. Join the Discord, and I'll see y'all. Uh, I appreciate y'all being here. If you hit that follow button, I'll appreciate it more. Be part of the hydrated fam. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see y'all on Friday, 6.30 p.m. Central Time. Peace. Stay hydrated. See y'all.